Hey everybody, J&A Review, and today we're at Triple HRV here in Haleyville, Alabama, Row Tide. And if you just found our channel, go ahead and subscribe, follow along with us, and give us a thumbs up. And she's shaking her head. That's so funny. <laughs> but anyway, today we're going to be looking at a 2024 LaCrosse by Primetime. Model number 3500 DB. So let's get started. The length on this LaCrosse is 39 feet. The dry weight is 8,723 pounds. And that hitch weight is 1,195. Yes. Now this is a, another LS model, which is a pretty well new floor plan for them. It is a new floor plan. Um, now we have done some lacrosse before and um, they're, they're a little bit heavy, so you're gonna need a really well-equipped truck for these. But right up front is where your water hookups are going to be, uh, cable, satellite, your battery disconnect, and your outside shower is all going to be located right here. Yeah. <laughs> oh me. All right, right here is going to have you um, some outside storage. You do have a light back there. It's not flipped on right now, but um, I do think it's motion activated. So. Yeah. Coming right on down the side. Don't trip over this corner. I'll try not to. Uh, one of your dump areas is going to be right here. Um, don't think we're going to be able to get around the back of this one because of the way it's... Uh, that looks like I will fall over. But your other dump area is going to be back here. And you do have a nice big storage area here. Cool. And just take my word, it's prepped for a ladder and a backup camera yeah. on the back. So... Let's go back around and not trip over this cord, and we'll show you the other side of it. Well, who put that cord there? I wonder. Now we're gonna try to put um, these out back to back. This floor plan and a previous floor plan are almost identical outside storage well it depends on which one i put out first well yes so if you like from here to here on one but don't like the end hang on you may like the other one that didn't make any sense but no, that's you okay. may like this one you may like <clears throat> this one um i love the big wide steps that lacrosse <clears throat> uses these are just they feel really good and really sturdy now coming in um do, like you said depending on which video comes out first you may have already seen this kitchen in another um another unit so this part is going to be the same we'll go ahead and start here with this big 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 tv nice entertainment center you've got a sound bar lots of storage underneath and even some open storage where you can slip shoes or things underneath. Okay. Right huge. next to that is this huge microwave. It is mm. just, just like residential <clears throat> size. You're going to have the split oven and cooktop here. Your three burner cooktop is going to be propane. But this is going to be an electric, electric. fireplace. Electric fireplace. fireplace. I like that <laughs> fireplace. An electric oven. Oh, right. <laughs> I knew you'd get that. Oh, I need some caffeine. So this is like, this is kind of new. The um, electric um, stove, um, the electric oven hasn't been yes. out too long. So we're, we'll see how this one goes. In the island, you're going to have a nice big single basin sink with a high rise faucet. You've got a drawer here and some storage underneath, plenty of room for a trash can if you want it. Finishing out this side of the kitchen, you've got a big French door style fridge with a pull out freezer. Yes. And on the other side of this island, you've got this extension leaf here. And, um, well, I can't figure out how to pull it up, but it will flip up and you can put bar stools under there if you want to and that'll keep it from opening going that's down the how road. it looks going down the road that's it right there <laughs> coming right. right on around you've got coffee this bar. really neat little nook area you can put your coffee pot crock pot uh, instapot no you can't either this one does not have a plug-in no plug-in right there 
Well, that's kind of useless. Okay, the other floor plan that we're looking at like this had a... Come on, prime time. <laughs> okay, this one could have <clears> been <throat> could have been Monday morning and they, they didn't get it all together. You, you did say something about this. I did, so okay, that's what it looks like when you pull it out. Yeah. And you do have a plug-in here at the end. Now, your heating vents are going to be in the floor in this one. And you are going to have whisper quiet air up here. Now, your slide is going to be on the front. This is on the camp side. So you have got a um, pull-out sofa here that will have some additional sleeping. And you've also got a freestanding table and chairs. Again, great big windows here on your camp side. So you can have some awesome views while you're having your morning coffee. Now, if you've watched... Um, the other floor plan like this, this room was a bunk room, but this one is a little bit different. All right. So if you have older kids or you travel with an, with an adult, they may not want bunks. So this is a perfect solution for this. This is going to have a queen size bed and it is a tilt, tilt bed. bed. Um, the button's over here. Oh, I didn't know where the button Right above the... Oh, uh, look at here. And it tilts fast. So this one goes up fast. I uh, do have a plug-in down there. There's no storage under this bed, but that's okay. We're going to show you something else in just a second. Oh, my word. How far does this thing tilt? <laughs> well, you have to do this when you pull the slide Well, in. yeah, to pull the slide in, it does have to go up. There you go. Okay, that's like standing up. Wow. That's a big tilt. I okay. Like that. All right. That's that's. I haven't seen one go that far. But <clears> anyway, because you don't have any storage underneath, you have all of this. So if you want to put a stackable washer dryer or a combo, you can do that, or you can use it for hanging, uh, or you can add some shelves. So lots and lots of storage options in here. Oh, now. But we're still not finished. My best part. There is even more. You are going to have a half bath. So you do have your little foot flush toilet here. And you've got a medicine cabinet with a mirror. A sink. And there's a little bit of storage below. And you've got plug-in. So again, if you've got an older, uh, maybe a teenager. Or you travel with your mom or your sister or your best friend or whatever. They'll have their own bathroom. And... Hey. Pretty good leg room in there. Right. Good place to count your money. Okay. <laughs> All right. Anyway, so <clears throat> let's go finish the rest of this lacrosse. Okay, I'd like to bump this. Okay, the main okay. bathroom is going to be um, dual entry, so it's got a corner shower. Now, like, good. All, like all of our previous videos, Jeremy's six feet tall, so good headroom in there. Okay. Mirrored medicine cabinet right there. Good space around your sink. A little bit of storage underneath it. Your foot flush toilet's at a great angle, so you have lots of leg room down here. And there is some storage right up above it. Cool. Okay. He can go in through that one, and I'll show you these control panels right up here in the hall. And moving right into the bedroom. And I just, I love the way LaCrosse does their bedrooms. Uh, you've got this big king size bed. It is on a slide. Um, there is going to be some storage underneath it. Actually, quite a bit of storage underneath it. You have a seating area at the front. Actually, if we if we took our cats with us, they would probably be oh, right there. Up here. And you've got hanging on both sides. An open storage across the top. Again, whisper quiet air in here. And at the foot of the bed, you're going to have a dresser area with a fireplace. I mean, a fireplace. Come on. All these drawers for storage. And wow. the TV hookups for this should be Over at the here. end. Yes. yes. They're on this side. So you'll have to get one that probably sits on this dresser and you'll just have to take it down for transit. And this is your great big storage. Wow. Yeah. Okay. Very, very nice. Very impressive. So again, this floor plan uh, from the front bedroom to here is exactly like the bunk room, but if you would rather have an extra bed, 
check this one out. All right, everybody. If you like this lacrosse travel trailer, the dealership's information be down in our description. And like always, if you just found our channel, go ahead and subscribe, follow along with us, give us a thumbs up and share. Thanks, everybody.